Hi, welcome to JMeter tutorial. So this is my seventh video I have created for JMeter tutorial. You can uh, watch my previous six videos. So in order to understand this video, in previous my video, I have shown you how to export our test result into a CSV file. Okay. Now I am showing how to export your test result, proper test result of JMeter into a normal TXT file. Okay. I have created thread group, five users, five loop count, two seconds. Okay. This is a request detail, HTTP request default, where I am using my server, means my website, I am using this is my blog. Okay. I have created this one. I am using actually recorded these HTML files. Okay. Simply you need to change the label name. Let me say once. Yeah. Okay, you need to change the label so that you can understand easily. Okay. APM interview questions. So, this is my label. These are the label names. Name. Okay, I am added a summary report from simple then listeners. Summary report. Okay. For export, I am using simple data writer. This is a data writer using for write what is result <coughs> sorry this result into a csv or txt file this is also available in listeners simple data writer okay i am giving txt okay this is a file you need to mention you should not create any file in this path just this folder should be empty Okay, this water name you have to give. You want to give, you can give. So I'm using software hyphen testing that takes this file will be automatically created in this folder. Okay. Previously I have created CSC file, comma separated values file. So now you know I'm creating txt file. Okay. Understood. This should be given in here only simple data writer should not create any text file in this folder okay why because jmeter automatically it will create let me save okay let me run see thread 5 into 5 25 one user will hit 5 times 5 into 5 25 every 2 seconds one user will hit 5 okay total hits means 25 25 25, 25 total is should be 100 see here Five already initialized. Five virtual users are running. Errors are zero. Throughput. Throughput means how much bytes you are using. It should be high every time. Bytes for your particular uh, CPU. My laptop. Kilobytes per second it is using. Okay, maximum this is a milliseconds. 0 0.2139 milliseconds. Minimum 0 0.063 seconds. 11.42 means average. So divided by thousand, so one point one second average. Okay. Okay. Let me say this. This is already written. Okay. Let me go to this path. See here, TXT file is generated automatically. If you open this one, you will create timestamp, elapsed, label, response code. Okay. There is no error. See, there is no error. Success, true, failure message, nothing. Bytes this much this much ideal than this one okay so like this you need to export your test test state sorry test result into txt file so in my previous session i have given csv you can watch those videos also okay if you like these videos please uh, share it and uh, subscribe for my videos and uh, please provide your valuable comments okay so before i am giving this this label name right label response code so i'm creating configure here and as per the configuration only it will save if i click on save url it will save the url if i click sample error concept header 
response data response file name everything will save into this file here it will save okay thank you thank you for watching my videos